you know, you shouldn't have this many kids because X, Y, and Z, like, oh, oh, you What's going on, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mahogany. You already know what to do. Make sure you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on that post notification bell so you're notified every single time I drop another video, guys. Okay? Also, make sure you comment down below if you're new here because I want to welcome you to the tribe. Okay? Um, but, guys, I'm so, so excited. This is like my first talk, sit down and talk, kind of chill vibe video of the year. I know, right? Of the year. And we're literally in April. But I am so excited to like be talking to y'all and you know just sharing a few things that are on my heart you guys see the title of the video and all of that so we're going to get into it but guys um right now it's like evening time um your girl is looking all cute mm -hmm. take a little few pics mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. pose okay um and so like i got these cute earrings from fashion over y'all i've been wanting to wear these so freaking bad and then um i got this necklace from some jewelry store i can't remember where um but this was like a cute little vibe-ish outfit i really loved it i actually went out to lunch today y'all in midtown and it was so freaking fire y'all i'm gonna put on the screen what i had to eat it was so freaking good um but y'all i am literally getting ready to get a salad the other day i went to olive garden and i got like a to-go salad and so i'm about to eat that salad now because i'm feeling like the salad vibes right now and i don't really want nothing heavy because I had lunch though, probably about, it probably was like about 2.30. And so it's only eight something at night right now. So I am due for like another meal per se, but I really don't want to eat nothing heavy. So I think the salad is going to do. Um, so I'm going to get that out of the fridge so that I can make it. And um, cause I got some stuff in there that I don't even like to eat. And so I got to take like the olives and stuff out. I'm going to let y'all see and everything, but I'm getting ready to make this salad. And then we're gonna sit down and talk. Y'all know that I love like sit down and talk videos. I love vlogs too. I do like a mix if you're new here. I literally do vlogs. I do sit down and talk videos. Um, sometimes I do like a get ready with me and all the pins. Like I should have didn't want today because your girl's look is looking face and all. But um, I just do a variety of different kinds of content. And so today is more so on the chit chat type of vibe. Let's get into it. All right, y'all, so I just finished um, making my salad per se. Here it is. As you guys watch me make it, I literally took out the jalapenos, the olives, and the onions. I can't stand onions in a salad or jalapenos and, and olives, but y'all, that was going to be a no for me. I used the dressing that it comes with, which is, one sec. What is this dressing to be? Oh, Italian dressing, duh. Italian dressing that it comes with. I really love that, it's so good. It's essentially what they have at Olive Garden. And so I'm literally getting ready to head over to the table, y'all, so I can eat this and get into our conversation, okay? All right, y'all, so I'm at the kitchen table getting ready to eat my salad. Oh, y'all, this smells like it's just gonna be so, so good. I'm about to dive in, but I am so excited. Today is actually April. Today is Thursday, April the 20th. Mm -hmm. And so this week has just been so, like so much has been going on this week. Um, all good things, um, of course. And so I know this week is the week that we literally came out with our pregnancy announcement on YouTube and on Instagram. We posted like photos today, actually. Yeah, today's Thursday. So we posted photos today. And then like we posted like a reel on Tuesday, kind of just showing like the video kind of part of it. And then on today, we posted like the photos from it. And so it was so nice being able to just share the whole announcement with you guys because like we've been wanting to share. But of course, every time we do an announcement, we want it to come off a certain way. And what I mean by that is 
we really want to capture the essence of how we feel, the beauty, the joy, give you guys an experience because every time we find out it's an experience for us. So we always like to give you guys an experience too because y'all are our family. So it's like, we just don't want to be like, hey guys, we're expecting, you know, we want it to be like a whole experience. That's important to us because of course y'all are our family and we want y'all to be able to experience these things too with us in like a joyful, beautiful way and in a creative way because of course we're creators and so what we do is create and so we like to create things that are unique different announcements that other people aren't doing trying to just capture our creativity our love our ideas our goals all in a video and so i'm so glad that y'all liked it if you haven't seen the pregnancy announcement make sure you guys head over to the jackson Valanda channel that's where it's at it's called the video is called we're pregnant and then in that you can see the pregnancy announcement but also guys really really quick want to tell you guys about my patreon make sure you subscribe to my patreon actually just watch this really quick video just to tell you like literally what's in it what's going on guys it's your boy justin and mahogany listen we have some exciting news that we want to share with you guys we are so so excited to announce that we y'all are on patreon okay yes guys so make sure you guys click the link down below right now and go make sure you become a it's all exclusive member all access okay. member of patreon yeah. tell them what's on patreon y'all it's gonna be so much exclusive content that you guys can't like you can't see this content anywhere else not on youtube instagram tiktok nowhere only on patreon it's gonna be like my ultrasounds for my pregnancy it's gonna be just upcoming projects we got going on movies productions i mean conversations like everything jackson's tv literally. entertaining everyone go over there right now to patreon listen you don't want to miss you can't miss it go over there and sign up right now it's something for everybody yeah on our patreon yeah but anyway we gotta go peace so y'all that's the patreon make sure you subscribe okay like you gotta be part of the patreon game but i am so excited y'all i don't like to kind of talk with my mouth full. like i really try not to so i'm gonna eat and talk at that time but and if y'all hear my kids in the background they're downstairs playing y'all um so they living their best life but I'm so excited just for this whole pregnancy. Um, just super excited for like being able to grow our family, continue to grow our family. It's like, I get so excited thinking about it because it's literally amazing just to be able to create, produce life. And when you're financially secure to be able to take care of your kids, when you can offer them, you know, the two parent household, not against those who don't have a two parent household, let me be clear, I did not grow up in a two-parent household at all. Um, and so to be able to really work hard and build a relationship that you love and with the person you love, and then from that you're able to have be married and have kids, it just brings me so joy, so much joy to just bring children into this whole life of what we created. And I just think as they grow later on just like sitting at the table and looking down the table and like at all the chairs of all your kids and everything and it's just gonna be like thanksgiving well every day essentially but like holidays and just everything is so much sweeter of course i know like not everybody can have a lot of kids like some people they don't have the patience for it and you know to each his own like i'm definitely hey baby i definitely don't you know have anything i don't knock people who want smaller families there's nothing wrong with it and i think one thing that i've definitely ran into is like people will try to project their like experiences or their um just feelings on you and they're like you know you shouldn't have this many kids because x y and z like whatever they might they're like you know if you have more kids and your kids won't be able to get that enough enough attention and so sometimes people will say things based on like their experience like they might have been a part of a household that had a lot of kids and they feel like their parent couldn't you know give them the attention they need whereas there's a lot of people that come from big households where or i know a lot of people now that have kids that have big families and both people say whether they were a child of it or they have that many kids they're like our child all of our kids get enough attention you know what i'm saying or they were like as a child i got enough attention so i think sometimes what people do is whatever their experiences is even with like having children back to back you know um 
there's a lot of people that did that back in the day, even now. And I mean, um, we see that it's not like uncommon, but you know, sometimes I know some women who they had one pregnancy and it about wiped them out. Um, and they're like, I couldn't imagine, you know, having to like, you shouldn't do that. Like, because then they're basing it off of like how they felt, you know, with theirs and stuff. And so, you know, I, I do know a lot of people will project like how they feel about, you know, their experience, what they've heard. And, um, that's why I'm like, so important to make sure that I like, I'm always talking about OB, like my OB actually y'all was like, y'all gonna be back. And I'm just like, uh, uh. and so, you know, Everything that I do, I always make sure that it aligns with like my health and everything. So, you know, actually they say like having kids back to back or more frequent, of course not just like you just, you know, having kids just for the heck of it. But like, if that's what you want to do, having kids back to back can help you reduce fibroids and just so many different things. And so I think sometimes people project how they feel or what their experience is on you and try to make you feel some kind of way about some news that you have. And of course, you know, I'm not worried about what people have to say. Y'all not care less. But I guess I'm sharing this, not I guess, but I am sharing this because I know so many of you guys, maybe not about pregnancy, but maybe about your goals. Like you want to start a business. You want to start a loungewear um, collection. You want to sell hair. You want to be a full-time travel hairstylist. Like you got goals, but what has stopped you from achieving them is people projecting their fears. Like you're not going to be able to accomplish that or that's too risky or that's going to cost too much. And the thing is, I want to encourage you to like, if you genuinely want to do something, whether it's build a big family or start a new business, go for it. And don't listen to what people have to say that are projecting their insecurities on you because people will do that. Even if they don't have negative intentions, sometimes people can project things on you and they not even aren't, they aren't even trying to be negative. It's just all they know. Their brain is familiar with that traumatic experience. And so they're almost doing it as a warning, but they don't realize that this isn't the case for everybody. Everybody doesn't fail at a business. Everybody isn't su not successful when they launch um, their collections. Not everybody fails at selling hair, you know, different things like that. So make sure that whatever you guys are doing, you know, I'm always giving encouragement, make, sh encouragement, make sure whatever you're doing that um, you have the people around you that support you, but also tell you the truth, of course. But you don't let people project things on you that stop you in your tracks. Um, always go with your gut because, like, your gut is your discernment. And God is, like, telling you, hey, this is what I want you to do. And so many people, they're, they're stopping their tracks because someone projected something. There's so many people who, you know, said things to me like, oh, you know, you'll never be able to be married young. And just different things like that. And it wasn't you know because like they hated me it was just because they saw so many failed relationships in their life or they saw so many they were a part of like a family that got married young and it didn't you know they end up divorcing and stuff like that and so i say all that to say if you want to do something make sure you do it and you take advice from people that are what's the word have take advice from people that have the credentials to speak you know and people who um you can tell the whether they are sharing something from a place of trauma a hurt or a projection or whether they are like genuinely you know trying to like you know tell you something so hope that encourages you guys um but it's been a sweet week for me y'all um not with just announcing our pregnancy but also guys you know i'm gonna be launching my loungewear it's coming soon right now we're in april and um my launch and release is going to be coming so so soon i can't wait for you guys to see the pieces oh it's gonna be so freaking fire guys like oh my gosh um i'm just so ready for it like i feel like i've been waiting for this for like a year <laughs> um just picking the pieces it's a whole process just picking the pieces and making sure that the fabrics feel right, making sure after you wash them that everything is still good, making sure they're soft, making sure they're not see-through. It's so, excuse me, so many trial and errors um, in the process of finding the right pieces, but I finally found them and I'm so excited for you guys to see them, experience them, wear them, walk around with your statement of, I'm not the guy I used to be, I'm ready for all of that. I'm also guys going to be redoing my book cover and so that's gonna be exciting. I'm gonna have a cover release party. I'm so, so excited um, for all that is to come. It's gonna be absolutely amazing. And so I'm excited to, um, during this pregnancy journey, to take you guys with me through my entrepreneurship journey. Of course, this is my first ball game. You know, I released my book, I'm Not the Girl I Used to Be. It's been a bestseller. Um, 
then an Airbnb host, done a lot of different things. So this isn't my first rodeo with a business, but um, I'm just really excited about this because this is my baby. Like this is like my story. I'm not the girl I used to be. It's like, it means so much to me. So I'm so excited for it to finally be coming to the forefront. And even though I'm pregnant, pregnancy doesn't stop anything from me just because it doesn't, you know, you're pregnant, but you're, you're creating life, but you don't have to like sit on the couch all day and not like and eat food and not do anything. Y'all know me, y'all know I'm always productive even while I'm pregnant. So I'm excited to just continue being productive and continue to create and continue to just bring so many other things that are my goals to the forefront. So comment down below if you're ready, okay? Comment down below, because it is going to be a release to remember. I'm going to take you guys with me to do the photo shoot, literally everything. So get ready, get ready, get ready. I absolutely can't wait. But guys, if you guys have any questions for me in the comments, definitely comment them down below and I'll make sure to answer them in my next video or answer them in the comments if it's like the right environment. What I mean by that is like, if you ask me a question that's really thorough, I'll probably answer it in my next video, opposed to like trying to write like a book in the comments. But definitely don't hesitate to ask me any questions. Um, of course, you guys know this is my fourth pregnancy. And so if you have just any questions just about pregnancy or what I'm taking, what I'm using, if you want me to do some videos about that, let me know. But just to give you guys what to expect on my channel, definitely definitely will be able to just see me go on my entrepreneurship journey of uh, releasing my brand you'll see me continue to create life um birth life and everything like that with my pregnancy you'll also just see so many things blossom and bloom so if you're ready for that journey definitely make sure you're subscribed make sure your post notification bell is on you'll see me go out and indulge and pampering because I love to do that too. So like, you know, get my hair done, lashes, nails, just don't we love those just maintenance days? I do. And so you'll see me do that. We'll just be creating vibes over here. We'll also have conversations because I love to talk about hard things. I love to just talk about things that we all are thinking, but we don't know how to navigate or just different things about my story. Like not growing up in a two parent home, growing up in a broken home, dealing with so much stuff and how I made it through because I feel like it's so many of us who can relate like there is so much to gain by sharing your story if you got a story share it because there's so much that you can do through your story you can help other people other people can be inspired so one thing about me is I'm always sharing my journey I'm always sharing my story where I came from to inspire you guys and to encourage you guys that the sky's the limit and then I love seeing y'all's comments about like how y'all are shooting things how y'all growing like this is what we do over here. Over on my channel, behind this world, this is sisterhood. This is love. This is a safe space. We don't do no negative vibes, no negative energy. If you ever see somebody negative in the comments, don't tell them, like, look, we don't do it over here, period. And so I'm just excited to continue to grow this community, create this community. If you aren't following me on Instagram, what is you even doing? Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Make sure you're locked in. Like, we going up, okay? Like, so much, so much is going to be in the no. But I'm getting ready to finish eating my salad because as y'all saw, I was giving y'all all the info, the details, the story, and I literally only took one bite. But how I feel about being pregnant again, y'all, I'm excited because it gives me an opportunity to create life. And I'm excited because I get to grow my family. I'm blessed, it's an honor, it's a privilege because a lot of people don't have that opportunity. A lot of people have had, you know, just so many things have happened and you know, I'm blessed to be able to have the opportunity. I don't take it lightly. And I'm just excited to take you guys on the journey of my pregnancy, on my entrepreneurship, on the releasing of my brand, um, the release of my book cover, just everything. And I want to see y'all grow as I grow. Okay? Can we, like, make a promise? Like, as I grow, you grow. You grow, I grow. We just grow. We love each other. We confident. We positive, lean with the negative vibes or energy. Like, can we, like, that's our thing over here. So, I love you guys so, so much. Like I said, this was just a chit chat video where we just talk it up. But if you have any questions, leave them in the comments for me. And I hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next one. Subscribe, turn that post notification bell on, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.